Okay. Um, hello, good evening to everyone. Can you hear me? Hello, good evening to everyone. Uh, can you hear me? Good evening, teacher. Yes, teacher. Good, good evening. evening, teacher. Yes, I can hear you. Okay, thank you, thank you. Uh, well, before to start class, uh, some of you were asking me uh, something about some exercises that we have in the platform. So if you can um, uh, go to those exercises, well, in the case of, um, let me see, the exercise, uh, 1.8, I mean, and 1.2, I mean, I mean, 1.2 and 1.8. So uh, those are the exercise that someone was asking me uh, about some answers. Uh, we're going to check. Um, Otilia, that's, that's your name, right? Um, this is Miss, Miss Sara Sandoval. Sí. Okay. Yes. Uh, can, can you tell me name. what are Can you tell me what are the the errors that you have in a platform on those exercises? I have problem with a platform. Okay. Tell me. What's your problem with with a uh, platform? I am sure why incorrect, but that error. It's an that error. Give me error. Okay, let, let's see. Uh, can you share with us? Um, can you share with us what are the answers that you are typing on those exercises? In the section one. One okay, we're going to start with two. section, I mean, uh, one, the exercise 1.2. That's the ones that we're going to be um, yes. trying to solve. Problem number three. Okay, you mean problem number three? Let me, let me try to find it. Okay, what happened with it? Uh, Tina, you visit your parent on the weekend? Do you? Let me, yes. I spent Sunday with them. I'm too busy to read the, of the week. And the answer is to spend, let me prefer to spend Sunday with them or uh, spend Sunday with them. Okay. Uh, in this case, we are not using spend as a main uh, word because the main word here is visit. Okay, that's mean that that's I, the. I worry in I worry in this in two. Okay, this in two. Always give me error. This in two. Okay, uh, Miss, can you can you type uh, the can you type here in the in the chat box uh, the answer that you are trying to um, give to that to this exercise? Okay, visiting parents on the weekends. Visiting parents. Okay. This is the, this is the, ah, Mr. Miss, Miss Men, Mendoza. Okay, uh, you have missing in parents on the weekends. Uh, okay. Uh, first of all, we don't have, we have here just weekend because we're referring just to one, um, to the weekend. That's mean, let me see, to visit your parents on the weekends, don't you? Okay, I'm to see weekend. 
Okay, we were we won't use the the plural form of, in this case, sir. Uh, and also we are going to use the um, subject. Yes, in this case, the subject is missing. Um, try in this way, okay? Try in this way and, and let me know. If you have the same error, I, I'm going to type it here in the chat box. I mean, um, the answer uh, should be like visiting her parents on the weekend. That could be an answer. Another could be, is it correct? Yes. This is correct. it correct? Uh, I had I had problems with the number six too. I was trying to how to. Can how you to can you card. can you give me um what is the answer that you're trying to type there? Actually, as I tried with storytelling on Saturdays, and that's it. Storytelling on Saturdays. Okay, you mean exercise six, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, uh guys try to try to with it with these answers, okay? And let me know in this case. Is correct. Is it correct, uh, Mr. Mendoza? You can try to uh, the same, but uh, you must add storyteller. Okay, at the end yes. in this way. Yes. Thank you. Teacher. Thank you, teacher. Okay. In my platform, uh, why visiting her parents on the weekend? In don't give me correct. Visiting. Visiting. Okay. Her party on the weekend. On the weekend. Is it correct or incorrect? Incorrect. Why? Because that's the correct one. Visiting her party. Can Maybe. you show me? Can you show me your screen? In that Maybe. way I can help you better. Maybe okay. she is using. Uh, tell me, Mr. Torres. Maybe it's, it's using uh, an S on weekends. Oh, maybe. Because I, I had the same problem. The same problem, yes. The, 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 thing, the thing in, the is, end, in this case, I... we, we have to use um, the singular name for it. Instead of saying okay. weekends, we're going to say like weekend. Weekend, only weekend, okay. Okay, um, anyone else has Yes, any teacher, it's correct that the problem that way. is uh, S. Yes, at the end, right? Oh, oh, okay, 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 perfect. So- um, Thank you, thank you. Is it, okay, okay, you're welcome. Um, well, is anyone else who wants to ask uh, something about um, any other of these exercises and that and, uh, you have in a platform? Uh, uh, 1.8. Oh, okay. Number, eight. number one. And uh, the youngest is the family. The nice thing is I get a lot of attention. Okay, uh, and the youngest in the family, the nice thing is I get a lot of attention. Okay. Okay, uh, in this case, what is the possible answer that you consider for it? The night, let me see. The night, the night scene, the night scene with I, I, the, permit me. 
I'm the youngest in the family is I get a lot of attention. Okay. Very good. But something is missing. Uh, Mr. Mr. Torres? Actually, I fail in all of them. <laughs> okay, in all of them. Oh, okay. Tell me. All what, of them. But what could be I, a possible answer that you... That you actually, consider? I try it with the nice thing to be the youngest of the family is to get a lot of attention. Okay, this is this is a problem here. You, you have it right. But um, the we have something that we haven't considered um, because we're discussing about infinity. Um, I mean, the gerund, uh, we have to use a, in this way, okay? The nice thing about being with ing, the, this means the oh, verb being, being the youngest in the family is that I get a lot of attention. Try to do it that way. Can you, can you write in the chat, please, Prof? Okay, I will try. Let me see. Uh, okay, in this way. Um, type it in the, in the chat box. You can check it there. Okay. Any other, any other question? Uh, yes. Uh, I, this, I uh, have the, the question, but uh, another, another, another unit. Yes, the number three uh, i i guess i, I have uh, the correct uh, sentence but okay uh, uh, let's see let's see wrong for the platform let's see can you type it in okay. the chat box i okay or read it okay. if you want uh, i'm gonna read it okay okay the bad part of being away at college is i miss my family or is that I miss my family. I've tried several, several choices. Okay, you mean the bad? Uh -huh. Okay. I've tried it with uh, the bad part of being, the bad part about being, instead of part with third. being. Sir, in this case, uh, we are not using the but because um, uh, when I use the, the superlative uh, word for it, instead of saying the bad part, we wanna say the worst, the worst, W-O-R-S-T, mm -hmm. okay. because this is, okay. this, is, this is a comparative uh, word. That's mean the worst thing. Okay. Okay, uh, and remember to use the German. In this case, I uh, wanna type it like, uh, the worst thing about working at night is No, 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 that... no, no, no. Uh, I, guess, I guess you're misunderstanding because I'm talking about the third one. Uh, the third one. The one uh, starts with, I'm away at college. The bad part oh, is got it. that got I miss it. my family. Mm -hmm. Oh, got it, got it. Oh, sorry, sir. Um, okay, it, it, you mean the bad part of? Of, of being. Uh -huh. Okay. Of being away uh -huh. at college is I miss my family. Or, or is okay, uh, my family. You, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna delete the part where it says at college because it's not needed in this case. You're gonna, you're gonna type it like, uh, the bad part of being away is, okay, is I miss my family. I'm gonna try, but. Or you could type it. Okay, try it with it. Mm, I'm going to no, no, it, it still wrong. 
You do you use uh, a period at the end and capital letter for the pronoun I? Yes. Okay. Let me let me. Let me I have a problem with that exercise because all my sentences were wrong. Okay. And, uh, uh, I I think I wrote them right because of the way you are explaining right now. Oh, okay. I, I think I did it fine in and the platform check it all back. Okay. Uh, the the thing here, sir, uh, Mr. Mendoza, uh, and Mr. Vasquez, and Miss uh, uh, Mira. So the thing here is that we're using that. And in this type of sentence, we have to omit it. That's mean delete delete that and try to do it that way. The bad part of being away is I miss my family. Okay, because the 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 uh, the pronoun because in this case uh, we we will need a a second pronoun because the the, the bad part of being away is just the subject that we're we're, we're gonna use. In this teacher. Case, teacher, may I may I uh, share my screen? To show you? Sure, do it. Okay, thank you. Okay, I got it. I think so. That is a miss, is a submit or is a boy in a between I because that is a I, I use when I don't have a, a nouns. Exactly, exactly. But, but um, in this case, sir, uh, let me see. In the bad part of being away is it's a meme uh, from, okay. Thank you. I got it. Okay. The, the bad part of being. Teacher, I have problem in could, other unit. Can I could, ask you? Could you see, yeah. teacher? Yes. Uh, uh, just give me a, a second, Miss Sandoval. We wanna try to solve this first. Uh, let's see, sir. The bad part of being away is. I miss my family. Oh my God. So uh, I you meet it at college as you said. Yes, yes, but that that's uh, that should be the answer. Family the but do you use capital letter at the at the at the beginning, right? Yes. The bad part. Uh -huh. Try to do it this way. It's a uh, kind of similar, sir. Like you seen, okay. you seen. Uh, the what part of being away is that I miss my family. In this case, we're we're going to use that. I have to tell you that I've tried several uh, choices. Several times. Do you try several mm -hmm. times that? Oh, but that's correct, teacher. Okay, okay. I don't know why, but that was correct. Must be like uh, using a uh, well, this case could be possible. Use a uh, that, yes, that we I I I I asked that and that made made it correct. Okay, okay. So, um, in this case, we're gonna use it with that, it's correct to use it too, but. Also, we can use it uh, with all that too. Like the bad part of being away is I miss my family because in this case, uh, okay, in this, in this second case, we're using a double subject. And for that reason, sometimes it's, it's, it's not needed. Uh, but if for the use of this platform, I think it's uh, correct to use it too. Um, okay, I, I I would like to understand because uh, since the direction says that it, it, that is optional. Yes, so it's optional. I understood. I, I can use it or not. Yes, you can use it. And okay, you can use it. So, uh, but um, in this case, you are referring to the same subject. So, uh, as it said, it's, it's optional, of course. Uh, but... Um, the correct one uh, should be like without using that because it's implicit in, in, in the sentence because you have a, a subject. 
Okay, uh, a few, min few minutes ago, I wrote in the chat that um, the, the sentence you, you gave us uh, okay. was the correct choice. But the trouble is that uh, the, it, it's hard to match the, the correct sentence that, that is uh, recorded in, on the platform. So exactly, to, to match exactly the, the exact phrase Okay. It's a little hard. Yes. Yeah. Yes, when, it is. When, when the, there are there are several choices uh, that are correct. Yes, there the, there are several choices. Um, in, in the platform, we're gonna find at least around six or eight uh, choices. Uh, in some cases, because in 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 the number uh, in the number three, we had just two uh, two options, no more than that. But in the other ones, you have at least six options. Let me let me see in numbers in the number five. We had one. Two. I got the number five. You got the number five. Okay. Yes. Can you read it, sir? Okay. One bad thing about being the oldest in the family is that I always have to babysit. I'm going to put the, okay. the sentence good. on the chat. Okay, very good. That, that's a correct answer. Yes. Another option oh. could be using... Um, you, excuse me, you dropped the article before all this? That's, that was? About yeah. being about being the oldest. Oh, you use it. Yeah, about being the oldest. The oldest. Yes, the oldest. In the family, uh huh. Is I in always. In the family. You're missing that. Is that I it, always? Is that always have to babysit? Oh, thank you. You have no. to correct it, sir, because you, you wrote um, the subject, I mean, the pronoun I um, before that. Sorry. In the chat, it's the sentence. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Miss Pastor. Maybe the platform had a, a one problem. Actually, I didn't Sorry. understand what to do until now. <laughs> okay. Okay, sir. So in this case, you you have both options. Uh, you can use that because it's correct to use it, but also you can use it without that. And that's another front to uh, type this kind of sentence. Uh, do you have any other question? Uh, uh, 2.5, 2 number 5. 4. Uh -huh. Just give me a second, wanna see. Um, do you already finish section one? Um, that question is for everybody. I'm done, teacher. You're done, okay. Very good. Fine. I finished, but I have I, I still have problem with that exercise because I write and rewrite the sentences and it always says it's wrong. Uh, Miss Mina, in, in the you mean the exercise that we're checking right now, right? That's yes. mean uh, 1.8. Okay, yes. uh, what is the, the, the um, sentence that you have wrong? <laughs> Everyone. Everyone. All, okay. the, all my sentences are wrong. Okay, um, can you share for your for screen? For example, uh, the number one I wrote. Okay. okay. I this one the number three I just corrected 
uh, when listening with what you were saying, I regret and now it's correct. But the other ones, I do it again and I, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Okay, okay. Let's see. Uh, you For mean, example, uh, this one, this uh, the nice thing of being the youngest in the family, I, I, I erased that. The youngest in the family is that I get a lot of attention. Okay, miss. Um, in this case, in the in the exercise number one, it uh, should be like the nice thing about being. Uh, you must change the the um, conjunctions. about being the youngest in the family, okay? Is that okay. or is I get a lot, a lot of attention? Is I get uh -huh. a lot of attention, okay? Try to... Okay, let's see. The nice thing about being the youngest in the family is that I get a lot of attention. Is that okay? Is yeah. that I get a lot of attention? And it's still wrong. Uh, let can, let me see why the nice thing of oh, the nice thing about being. Let me see. The youngest. Youngest is wrong. Right. Ah, okay. You're missing I, I miss thing. Yeah, thank you. I didn't notice that. Oh, okay. That's a mis misspelling. Okay. Now the trouble. The trouble. Okay, you have a try. I have to write also about. Yes. Instead of all. Instead of of yes, you, you need uh, okay. about. Okay. Um. The towel about having a younger, younger sister. Is she always? Um. Uh, in that case, let me see. Younger sister is she? Okay, she always. The trouble about having a younger sister is she always wants to borrow my clothes. I don't understand. It says it's wrong. Um, I'm going to do it this way. I'm going to share the correct answer. Okay. The check box and then just copy and paste uh, the following. Miss. Just copy and paste the, the, the answer. Is still incorrect? Yeah, I, I don't know because it, it seems one one letter or one space. If there's space. Maybe uh, if you're using double space, uh, do you copy and paste the, the answer that I, I type in the chat box? Please? No, no, no. Go there and uh, just copy and paste. It's the same answer, okay? Just copy and paste. Let's see what happened. Because I can see the error. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, um, wanna see the exercise from Miss Andoval. Miss Mira, I'm going to help you using the uh, WhatsApp group, okay? Uh, I'm going to contact you uh, after, um, after this okay, video conference. Okay, uh, my, my, my issue is that, as the other person say, if you don't write, uh, exactly, if, if exactly, the yes. word is right, if you don't match exactly what the platform yes. says, that's, says that's it's true. wrong. Yeah, that's true. Actually, teacher. Uh, okay, tell me, sir. If you want it, I can help. I can help her. Just make a a breakup room. I go. I can help her. Okay. Uh, give me Thank a second. You. I'm going to do. It. Okay. Miss Mira. Okay, uh, Miss Mira, uh, Mr. Torres is going to help you, okay? Just accept the, the, the invitation for the breakout rooms. After you finish, please come back here. Okay, teacher. Okay, guys. Uh, well, we're going to see the last exercise that Miss um, Sandoval said, that is 2.5. Uh, let We're going to take a look of it. Number four. Uh, 2.4. Mm -hmm. uh, 2.5 uh, acts number four. Exercise number four. Ah, okay. Very good. Um, what happened with it? Uh, I want the, I write and give me error. What is the option you uh, have? Will don't always make his problem worse. Okay. I why aggravate? How do you say aggravate? Aggravate. Aggravate. Okay. Aggravate. Mm -hmm. Or okay. aggravate, but only give me error. Mm, okay, uh, I got it. Um, in this case, you wanna use it in pass because uh, of the sentence. Jill don't always uh, make his problem worse. That's mean aggravate with ed at the end. Ed, thank you. It's correct that. Okay. Um. Very good. So we're going to uh, go to the um. Give me a second to the topic that we're going to discuss this night. Um. If you have a question, please let me know um, in the WhatsApp group. I'm going to try. Um, I will try to uh, solve it as soon as possible. Maybe I can contact you using uh, that um, that um, uh, well that group in this case. Um, we're going to to know something about the compound family terms. Uh, I asked you uh, before starting this this um, class uh, to bring a bone paper and also pencil and pen uh, because we're going to do an activity. First of all, we're going to see um, what are the compound names or compound family terms in this case. Um, in a family, we have like different members, okay? Um, and we're going to try to guess what, um, what is the member the man referring to according to the sentence that we're gonna read here in the following slides, okay? And you, you're gonna try to, to, to guess. Um, for instance, in the number one, this is the, the, the first activity we're gonna, gonna see. Um, this person, okay, it's a member of our family, is a, your father's or mother's grandmother. Do you know who's that person? Your father's or mother's grandmother. Who is? You can type it in the chat box. 
I think it's my grand grandmother or something like that. Grand grandmother. Let's see. Okay. Yeah. The number one is great grandmother. Okay. Great grandmother. Very good. Your your class. Okay. The second one. Let's try. Uh, this person is the father of, of your father and mother. It's my grandma. My grandfather. Grandfather. <laughs> grandfather. The grandfather. Grandfather. Very good. Excellent. So, uh, the next one. The wife of your son. We're back. Sister in law? The sister in law. Are you sure? Mm, no. <laughs> Mother in law. I don't help you. Daughter in law. No, it's daughter in law. Yeah. Daughter in law. Daughter in law. Yes, that's right. That's the correct one. Daughter in law. Very good. Let's see the next one. Okay. Teacher. Is the the cuñada. No, pero no sé qué hizo. Sí. Tell me. Sorry, the, 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 the brother-in-law. Brother no, I, I, I can hear you. Someone asked something, but I, I couldn't hear. Brother-in-law. Brother-in-law. Oh, brother-in-law. This, this is the husband of your sister, okay? Yes, that's the correct one. Brother-in-law. Very good. Uh, in the in this one, okay. The sister you only have one parent in common with. Step sister. Sorry. Step sister. Step sister. Okay. Okay. Uh, do you have any other one? Do you agree with with it? I agree. Yes, I agree. Okay, very good. Uh, yes, but also it is known like half sister. Okay, is it correct? Is it correct? But also it's known like half sister. It's a new for me. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Um. Let's see this one. The father of your spouse. Father in law. Father in law. Your father in law. Easy. Very good. Excellent. That one. That one was easy. And this one. The pattern. The parents of your parents are. Your grandparents. Grandparents. Okay. Let's see. The answer is your grandparents. Very good. Okay. So uh, as you notice there, in, in all of them, um, in all of the answers that we have here, we have what is called a compound family terms. Okay. Why, why those are called compound family terms? Because they are composed um, with different words, like grandparents. Okay, like mother in law. That's what is called a compound noun. A compound noun. Um, give me a second. If someone has the microphone open, give me a second. Uh, go to me. And this. Okay. Sorry, guys. Um, well, in this case, we have uh, that, that those terms that are called. Um, compound nouns, uh, terms in this case, compound from the terms, uh, that we can use it um, in, in different sentences. Um, the activity, well, that you're going to, to develop is based on this. We're going to see what are the nu nuclear family, the extended family, the joint family, the blended family, and family by choice. Uh, first of all, we're going to define uh, each uh, of it or each term in this case. Um, and you're going to help me. In the case of the nuclear family, can you tell me who are the members of a nuclear family? 
my sister, my brother, my father. Oh, my father, my mother. Okay, very good, excellent. Um, in the case, the case of um, the extended family, do you have any idea of it? My uncle, my aunt, my grand, okay, my grandfather. Very good, excellent. Any other? Uh-huh. Any other one? Okay. Standard family, right? Like yes, yes, I said standard family. A cousins. Okay, very cousins. good. Excellent. Yes, in this case, uh, we have the, all of them. Uh, also, there we, we're going to find like, um, like, well, till the three generations of, uh, of our family, like grandparents, like uh, grandchildren, okay? We're going to find all of them. Uh, th this is the extended family. Teacher. Since grandparents. Teacher. Did, uh, fam family by choice uh, maybe be uh, the friends yes family by choice are, are those persons that um we consider like like members of our family this could be like recognized by a legal system or uh sometimes a uh, are those persons that decide to form a family and do not correspond to um, those groups that we know, like the nuclear family, extended family, uh, like joint family or blend, blend family, all of them, okay, we have like a, a each of the characteristics uh, of the family. But in the case of family by choice, there is a group of family that, uh, cannot be included in this type of, of family, okay? Because uh, they, they, uh, they are recognized uh, as a type of a family, uh, but they are not included in the first one, in the second one, and third one, or, or in the fourth one example that we have here. Uh, do you know, in the case of joint family, who are uh, the... the people that compose this, this family. Joint family. family. Huh? I don't know, joint family. Maybe, maybe the, uh, is the case when uh, parents are divorced. Divorced. And they, and they uh, remarried or married again, I mean. Yeah. Um, no. Okay, in this case... It could um, be my husband? Yes, exactly, yes. In joint family, is our husband because um, a, the, this type of family are composed a, with the members of the family of other, of our husband, of our um, a wife, okay? In, in, in this case. All the members of his uh, his or her family are member of my joint family. Okay, this case could be like a spouse, uh, siblings. Example, maybe cousin. Siblings, yes. Uh, children. Okay, those, those are like joint family. Um, then we have the blended family. Do you know what are those? Uh, I guess the blended family, it's uh, when you have a, a, a other member to the, 
well, 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 wait a minute. It's a girl, a boy. They get together and they have uh, children from the other's uh, relationship and they yeah. form a new family. Yes, something like that, yes. something like that. And also, okay, two, two. and also, exactly, yes, that, that's the correct answer, sir. Um, and also, someone mentioned something before, okay? Uh, the children of, um, of, of well, who was the ones to, who participate before that said that uh, we also have to include the uh, children of our uh, wife or, or husband? Teacher, in the blended family, okay. uh, there are uh, movies that they eat your children, my children, and our children. Yeah, yeah, that's a good example of it. Yes, that's a blended family. Yes, um, and also uh, I consider like a blended family, like those people who's, uh, who's, who are divorced or widow. Um, in, in those cases, we also are considered, we also consider, I mean, a blended family. So in this case, we are going to do an activity, but we are going to um, to do a family tree using the extend family. We're going to try to include all of, all, all of the members of the family in the bone paper that you have. After you finish it, uh, you are going to send me that activity to the WhatsApp group, and then I, I'm going to take a look of it and I'm going to give you a feedback for each of the, um, the teacher uh, mister sorry how do you say brother and sister how do you say both brother and sisters the siblings, siblings. siblings. thank you okay I don't remember that word okay okay so uh, uh, that's teacher, what you are going to do her. Tell me, sir. I have a question. I have a question. Uh, are we going to include uh, members of the family that that are died? That died. Uh huh. Or just uh, just their you, life. You okay? In this case, sir, um, you are not to. Uh, well, in this case, uh, could be. Let me see. You are not to. You are not um, going to write the name of your family members. You are going to write uh, who are those person. Like for instance, if it is your uncle, your uh, grandfather, those are the names that I need in the in the family tree. No, the names of your family. I don't know if it's understood in that way. It doesn't matter if they, if okay, they died. You. you are going to create your family tree based uh, based based on it. Uh, if they died, you have to include it too. Uh, but you are not going to write the name of of of, um, of them. You are going to Mister, write just the title. My family is very very big. There are uh, twenty one siblings. Twenty one siblings. Si. <laughs> okay. In this case, just try to try to do it. Um, Los Angeles Azules, le dicen. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. In this case, same, try to do it. Same father, same father, different mother. Oh my God. Okay. But in this case, uh, try to include some of them. No, no, not all. Just some of them, in order to 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 um, just take a look of of your family tree. Okay, do you have your bone paper? If you have any question, please let me know. Sí. 
Okay, guys. Um, do you have any any questions uh, for me? Because the time is over, and um, if you haven't finished, you can send it later to 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 the WhatsApp group. Okay. Um, and, I, and I'm going to uh, let me see. Okay, you're sending the the, the exercise. Let me see. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Um, I was I was telling you that if you have any any uh, any questions for me, uh, you can let me know there in the WhatsApp group, uh, and I will be trying to solve it as soon as possible. Um, and I have to move from here because I have a, a different group to attend. 
uh, for that reason, if you haven't finished a uh, completed, okay, I, I, at your own, but send it to the WhatsApp group. Uh, something that I have to mention is that we have like a, a schedule. Um, it supposed that we have to finish the section number one uh, um, during this week, okay? In this week, we're going to start the section number two because uh, for this coming uh, Thursday, we're going to take the midterm. That's mean that we're going to develop the section number one, section number two, and also the midterm that we had for, uh, I mean, that we have at the end of the section number two. So please complete all the exercises Remember that you can work out if you want. If you want to complete all the exercise, it's okay. Don't worry, you can do it. Um, and then you can be like attending the video conference. It's okay. Uh, but if you want to follow like step by step, you can do it too. Uh, but try to solve those exercises. Don't leave it, leave it in blank. Because um, remember that you need at least the 80% of uh, the exercises, at, at least you must, you must solve uh, the 80% of those exercises in order to get the diploma and the certifications that, um, that let uh, you uh, join the, the, the next group, that's mean advanced two. So please do it and, and try to solve it as soon as possible. Uh, that's all, do you have any question? No? No, no, no question. No, no teacher. Okay, thank you. So, thank you. Um, thank you for letting me know. Very good. So, um, well, have a nice night and I will see you tomorrow at eight o'clock. And uh, blessings for all of you guys. Good night. Okay, thank you, teacher. Good, night. good evening. Good, good night. night to everyone. Thank you. Good night. Good evening. Good evening, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night for all of you guys.